the head here we're going to work on. So we've got it all glued together good. <clears throat> we've added some inch and 5 h end screws on the sides. We've got the screw on the back here and here. So if you have to take this off, you unscrew these two screws and then this back piece will come off if you ever have to get inside to do anything. So we're going to work on this. First thing we're going to do is we want to shave this all down so it's level before we start carving on it. Make sure you have the, your back piece in when you put it in your vise. Otherwise you put too much pressure on these sides and they're going to split on you. Uh, we're going to be using this cutting tool here to shave it down and then these different burrs that we're going to use different size burrs and I found these on Amazon and these work really well these are very good burrs to use uh, Krutzall burrs and they're eighth inch shafts so it works in your Dremel or your facsimile of your Dremel also bought this, I saw this on there, and what you do is you take your uh, little sanding disc and stick it on here to sand it. Don't waste your money on it. It doesn't work. The discs fly off too quickly, and if you don't catch that, then you end up sanding this down, then they don't stick at all. So this is a waste. Uh, with these, what I did was I punched a hole in the center of them, and then I put four of them on here, so I can use the sanding discs on there so that worked out pretty good because I can still use the sanding disc because that came with a lot of different discs so punched a hole in that screwed them into this for my Dremel and this works really good for sanding down that way so that works good but don't waste your money on this it doesn't work so we're going to work on this head here and we're going to shave this all down
my videos, please like and subscribe on my YouTube page. I'd appreciate it. If you have any questions or comments, put in my comment section. I'll get back with you. So now we're going to line this out a little bit, make some reference lines. get us started. We're going to start with this nose part. We always want to start on the center and work our way out. So we're going to start with this small burr and then we'll go to the larger one. side to side till we get it down to where we want it. We've got to take all this part off in here and we won't do too much in here until we get our nose and our cheeks set. Then it gives me a better idea where I want to put my eyelids for this guy. So we'll stop here and then we'll start with a new video. Thanks for watching.